Hi there, hope you're doing well. I'm Tony Sanzeri. Thanks for watching Sports Central on Lake Tahoe TV. Coming up, we'll be talking with Corey McCartney of Sports Illustrated and SI.com about a little NASCAR. We begin though with a couple of news and notes from around the sports world before we get to that interview. Colin Kaepernick, local boy, was drafted by the San Francisco 49ers. And Virgil Green, who was on our show last week, he also was drafted. He was drafted by the Denver Broncos. The San Francisco Giants and the Washington Nationals played in Washington over the weekend. The Washington Nationals took that series, and the San Francisco Giants, well, they got one game out of three. Uh, there's our scores right there. Pete and I, we make predictions. We keep our tallies on who won and who lost. He's 11-9. and nine, I'm 10-10. Ten and ten. Okay, in local sports, the Wattel High School Warriors beat the South Tahoe High School Vikings yesterday in baseball. And Wattel High goes into the playoffs this year with a chance to repeat as the state champions in the state of Nevada. All right, let's switch gears, talk a little NBA basketball. Let's talk about the Celtics and the Heat. Two teams many people thought would be in the NBA Eastern Conference Final. Well, they're in the round two right now of the NBA playoffs. And last night, the Miami Heat took a 2-0 to lead. They go to Boston next, and Shaq is back. So the Miami Heat, the Boston Celtics, big series this weekend in Boston. I like the Heat. Pete, he also likes the Heat in that first game. All right, let's bring in our guest, sports writer, Sports Illustrated, Corey McCartney. He is a NASCAR writer with Sports Illustrated. Corey, thanks for joining us on Sports Central. Thank you. All right, let's talk some NASCAR. Corey, I know it's a daunting task, but quickly break down the NASCAR season thus far for us in the Sprint Cup Series. Well, we're, we're nine races in, but I think the Cup season so far has really just been defined by surprises. And you got Trevor Bain, who became the youngest Daytona 500 winner ever at age 20. And then you got Dale Earnhardt Jr., who seems to have his career revived with a new crew chief and Steve Tart, And then Denny Hamlin, who a guy that, you know, everyone, including myself, who were picking as the preseason favorite to dethrone Jimmy Johnson has really just struggled. Nice weekend last weekend, but for the most part, just really struggled through these first three months. Great. Paul Menard, probably been the most improved driver this season. Any reason why in particular? Well, you know, growing up in the Midwest, uh, Menard is a big uh, home improvements tour there, and he, when he came up, he had that sponsorship with him, and it's kind of gone to, to you know, organization to organization with him, and that was kind of what he was known as. But I think with him moving to Richard Childress Racing, we're really seeing, you know, what can happen when he's got great equipment around him. Uh, you know, it's not the knock against Richard Petty Motorsports, but, you know, Richard Childress Racing has championship-level cars, and I still want to see him be able to do it across the long haul, but at this point in the season, you know, he's definitely looking like a gamble that was worth it for RCR. Okay, good stuff. We're talking with Corey McCartney from Sports Illustrated. He's a writer for SI.com. we got about 25 seconds left, Corey. Five in a row. Can J.J. make it a sixth? Well, Carl Edwards, Kyle Busch, and a lot of the other guys are looking like really strong challengers, but, you know, the problem is can they deliver in the chase? You know, there's a reason that Jimmy's put together this unprecedented streak. He's just been that much better than everybody else in those last ten tracks. Mm -hmm. If you look at last year, Hamlin, he rallied against him. No matter what happens in the 26 races before, as long as Jimmy gets in the chase, he's the man to beat until somebody else can do it. Good stuff. Thanks for joining us, Corey. We appreciate it. Go right, check it you. out. SI.com. Get your subscription to Sports Illustrated. That does it for Sports Central. I'm Tony Sanzeri. Thanks for watching.